The economy in Pakistan is on the verge of collapse. Every day, the Sheba Sharif government comes up with new rescue measures. Apart from power outages and fuel price hikes, the nation's fate has now been tied to its tea consumption. One less cup of tea a day is what has been suggested to keep the country's econom economy afloat. The suggestion has come from Pakistan's Federal Minister for Planning and Development, Ehsan Iqbal, who has urged the people in Pakistan to reduce the amount of tea that they drink. He believes that sipping fewer cups a day would cut Pakistan's high import bills. मैं ये भी कॉम से अपील करूंगा कि हम चाय की एक एक प्याली दो दो प्यालियां कम कर दें क्योंकि जो चाय हम इंपोर्ट करते हैं वो भी हम उधार लेकर इंपोर्ट करते हैं द स्टेटमेंट इज नो लेस देन अ शॉक ऑफ पाकिस्तानीज एज देयर लव फॉर टी इज ग्रोइंग ईच डे द रिक्वेस्ट टू रिड्यूस टी ड्रिंकिंग हैज गॉन वायरल ऑन सोशल मीडिया देयर आर डाउट्स whether cutting out the caffeinated beverage can really solve the country's serious financial problems Pakistan is the world's largest importer of tea It bought tea worth more than 600 million dollars last year according to data of Pakistan's Bureau of Statistics the tea imports during July last year to February this year were recorded at 423 million dollars against the 379 million dollar tea import during July 2020 to February 2021 The tea imports during March 2022 were recorded at 63 million dollars against the imports of 55 million dollars in February last year Pakistan's foreign exchange reserves have now dropped from around 16 billion dollars in February to less than 10 billion dollars in the first week of June. It is barely enough to cover the cost of 2 months of all of its imports. To protect funds, officials restricted the import of dozens of non-essential luxury items just last month. Pakistan is now facing a deepening energy crisis as well. For a country on the brink of bankruptcy, international monetary fund bailout is the only hope. and to remove hurdles in reviving the IMF program there could be more hikes in prices of fuel as the IMF has insisted on abolishing the subsidies on petroleum products in the wake of the continuous rise in fuel and dollar prices pakistan's domestic airlines have also increased their ticket prices by 25% and in another bid to conserve fuel and electricity pakistan's khyber pakhtunkhwa province has decided to allow public sector employees to work from home on fridays Beyond World is One is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news updates on the move.